It is time to review the 2014 Gratitude to God calendar system by Positive Christianity. This year, system number 2.0. This is a system right here that we offer in pocket size calendar form that you can carry with you. It also has a built-in pen that comes out so you can record your blessings when they happen so you won't forget. And it has many other things like 52 of our positive quotes. We include with every calendar we include the full instructions. But as you know our calendars sell out quickly. You may not be able to get one unless you order very soon. So you can create your own. I'm going to give you the 12 life transforming steps right now. First of all, you put God first. Every day you make an appointment with God for Thanksgiving prayer. This appointment will be just to show gratitude and thankfulness, not to ask for anything. You write down the appointment time and you keep the appointment, knowing that God will always keep the appointment with you. Next, count your blessings. Write them down daily. Look for and write down the things that you're thankful for each and every day in the present on the lines provided on the calendar. Don't tell yourself, I'll remember later because you won't. Write it down and give thanks to God for all your special blessings. And then at the end of the day, review and count all your blessings. Focus on what's right, not on what's wrong. Remember your blessings from God in the past as well. Banish regret. Forget the troubles that pass your way, but never forget the blessings that come each day. Then you will review weekly. You'll feel the gratitude for your blessings becoming accumulative in your mind. You'll review monthly. You'll see with absolute written down fact that God's good overwhelms the bad, causing waves in you of joy and gratitude. You'll reflect on yearly. On Thanksgiving Day yearly, you'll spend the entire day, not just a few minutes before a meal, giving thanks to God, reviewing your calendar, reviewing your year, reviewing your blessings that you've had, taking inventory of all the God-given good in your life. And you'll also remember the blessings that you have given to others through giving back. You're going to become thankful for your life. No life is perfect until you fall in love with it. You're going to practice loving your life. It will become a natural habit. You're going to also be thankful for you. Self-esteem comes from focusing on what's right instead of what is wrong. You're going to give thanks for your God-given gifts and abilities that make you a unique and special human being. And you're going to practice being the person that you want to be. You're going to give yourself added value also for the good service that you do for others. You're going to be thankful for other people. You'll give thanks for people that have made a difference in your life. You will strive for up arrow days. You'll begin to take the reins of your mind and retrain your mind to be constantly positive through daily practice. Days that you're positive, the majority of the time you'll place an up arrow on your calendar page. Days where you fall short with negative thinking, cynical or critical thinking, or a general bad mood, you place a down arrow on your calendar. Awareness is 90% of changing your mind. 
You'll review your calendar often and strive towards a conscious change with more and more up arrows in your life. You'll praise only. Every day that you go through without criticizing once anyone or anything, including yourself, draw a star next to that date that you succeed. You'll also praise through complimenting often. You'll make it a habit. Thanksgiving. Don't judge each day by the harvest you reap, but by the seeds you plant. You're going to give back for the blessings that you have received. You're going to put yourself in service. Volunteer. Get involved with something other than yourself. It all begins with you. Have a prayer not to change the masses, but to change just one person, to bless one person. All through the day you wonder, is this person going to be the one today? 365 different possibilities in 2014, and you will make a difference. Become a role model for others. Others will be watching what you do and desire to do this themselves. You give yourself, it is the only real gift. Pray, dear God, use me. Well, I pray that you'll make this next year, beginning right now, a tremendous year of gratitude, a year of uplifting your conscious thinking, your awareness, so that you find the true joy, the true good of God.